Mike, thank you. And of course, we're in downtown Colorado Springs here at Widener Field. And in a matter of minutes, in fact, we are expecting these drapes uh, to be dropped down to show us this new art installation. You can see uh, dozens of people out here to see all of this happen. Truly an exciting day in this community. All of these art pieces are going to be paintings uh, from, of course, famed artist Leroy Neiman. Neiman's art also showcased in the new Olympic and Paralympic Museum. His art becoming a staple in parts of downtown. We are in the Mill Street neighborhood, Colorado Springs' second oldest neighborhood. And having this kind of installation here, something neighbors on the Neighborhood Association and those working on this project say was really important to them. Art really talks about the beauty of life, and, and we're able to now, instead of having a commercial sort of appeal to the stadium, we now appeal, I think, more broadly to a group of folks who are going to be able to see this on a daily basis. Widener Field will open next month with the Switchbacks Grand Home Game opening on May 21st and covering Colorado tonight. Pandemic certainly highlighted a lot of challenges, especially the ones that renters and landlords face. But a new Denver startup is trying to make the market work better for both parties. In fact, hold on one second. I believe we're just about to have these art installations be shown off here in just a second. Don't want you guys to miss this. just incredible. Of course, this is something that really means a lot to this neighborhood.